my name is Camila. Uh, I am a sober lush, um, and that is what I'm going to be making some videos about for this series. Uh, what is a sober lush, you might ask? Well, um, I was, until very recently, what you might consider a lush, which for those of you who don't know, is somebody who really enjoys alcohol. Um, <laughs> too much, maybe. Uh, and that's kind of where I arrived at in my life, as I was drinking a little bit too much, and I wanted to stop drinking so much, but I still really enjoy um, beer. And so, uh, and, and other drinks as well, fancy drinks in general. Uh, so I decided to, um, as part of getting sober, I was part of becoming the sober lush and not just the lush. I decided to uh, start drinking more and more non-alcoholic beers. And uh, eventually I decided to start reviewing them, which is what I'm doing here and now. I would like to review a beer for you today. Um, and the reason that I'm doing this is two part. One is that I really would like, well, three part actually. One reason is that uh, it was hard for me when I was first looking for non-alcoholic beers to try to find reviews of them and to find kind of accessible content about non-alcoholic beer. It's a really great drink uh, now that I've gotten into it, but sort of learning about what the options were and kind of what the best ones were was, uh, was a bit of a challenge and I'm still not there yet, but um, definitely learning more and more every day. Um, another reason that I wanted to do this is so that I'm not a very rememberful person, I'm a very forgetful person. Um, so I would like to do some reviews that are videotaped to, um, to be able to remind myself what I like and what I didn't. Uh, so that's another reason. And then the third reason is actually as of tomorrow, uh, I am officially one year sober, uh, and so I'm very excited about that. And I've been wanting to do this series for a really, really long time, and so I figured, why not? Why not today? Why not now? Uh, so yeah, those are my reasons. Uh, thank you for clicking on this video for whatever reason you did. Um, and let's jump into it. Uh, so what I would like to review for you today is Heineken 0, 0.0. I've been seeing a lot uh, of social media recently uh, posts about this beer. And so I feel like they're doing a bit of a push right now. I don't know if that's accurate or not, but um, I've tried a lot of the non-alcoholic beers that you can find in stores. Uh, so I don't think I've ever tried this one. And so I'm going to give you first impressions as a way of celebrating my one year of sobriety um, and, and give you, you know, hopefully try a new beer for me and hopefully give you my initial reactions. So, yeah, uh, it's a pretty, like, it looks like a regular, regular beer, which is important to some people if you're at, like, a social event and you don't really want to be open about your sobriety. Um, so definitely, like, points for that one. It's not super important to me. I'm pretty, pretty open about being sober, but um, for some folks it is, definitely. Uh, yeah, so let's, uh, let's give this guy a go. I've got my trusty bottle opener here. Uh, it's got a slightly different function these days which is good for everybody. It is, however, kind of a tricky one. Cool. All right, so here's, here's our dude. Here's Heineken uh, 0, 0.0. Smells good, smells like a beer. Smells like, smells like college. Uh, not to perpetuate any weird stereotypes. Um, brewed in Holland, it's exciting. Very effervescent, very bubbly. Cool. Also, apologies like for any animal noises. I have lots of birds and lots of cats and I fed them all before taping, but you never know with animals. Sometimes they just decide to make noise. That's really good. Uh, yeah, that's really refreshing. Uh, look at all that bubble. So, first impressions. This is a delicious beer. Um, I am very excited about having discovered this. Uh, and let's see. So, very. My first impression is citrus. Lots of orange. Uh, that's that's cool. Because sometimes with non-alcoholic beers, you just get like weird aftertastes and weird flavors. So, um, like seriously delicious uh citrus and like i said kind of almost like a don't 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 pick on me for this but almost it tastes kind of like a corona um or at least what i remember a corona to taste like so yeah that's really good uh 
Yeah, a very mild, definitely a very mild taste. Some beers are more, like, aggressive, but this one is not an aggressive beer. It's a very light, light beer. Uh, and I suppose that's the 0, 0.0. Like some of the non-alcoholic beers, as you might be aware, actually I think typically it's up to 0. 0.5. Um, so that's, uh, that usually adds a slightly different flavor, but uh, the 0, 0. 0.0 ones, I think this is probably the most flavorful, like zero alcohol beer I've, uh, I've had. Um, it's really, really good. Um, so highly recommend. This is kind of what the pour looks like. Uh, not a great cup, so my bad. But uh, very amber color, as you can see. Kind of a, a nice little bubbly head there. Uh, bubbles are still rising. So again, this is a very kind of refreshing, uh, summery beer. It reminds me of summer, that's for sure. Cool. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this review of Heineken 0.0 .0 non-alcoholic beer. Uh, ignore my cat. Please subscribe if you are in the mood to do so. You can also follow me on Instagram. The information is in the uh, caption below. So thank you. And hopefully I will see you again. Bye.